He curls, gets to the rim. It's good. A two-pointer. And John Wall with 30 points. You're not going to see a better possession in the NBA from both sides of the ball. Good defense, good offense. Good offense won out that time. Nice ball movement. Gibson jump shot. The Bulls with the offensive rebound for a new 24. Beal against Miritich. Wall on the drive, throws it down the rim. Hey, sometimes good offense beats good defense. There's nothing to be ashamed with on that possession. That was a well-defended, well-contested shot. Gibson's working hard, backing down his opponent. Gets it right back. A powerful slam. A look at the athleticism exploding up to finish with the hammer. Tries it again. Jump shot for two, won't go. Hey, you're not a one-man. Team, you've got to spread the ball around so that you can get better shots than that. A coach cannot stand for those type of shots. Rosen shot, misses the mark. Nails it. That's a two-pointer. And Taj Gibson with 14 points. Hey, you want to have a good first shot, but it's more important to have the floor balanced so you have enough rebounders who can give you second shot opportunities. Right here, good use of the second shot, not only in getting the rebound, but putting it back in. Gibson, the rebound. He's averaging six boards per game this season. Gets the wide open look for three. Nails the jumper from downtown. And that's the fifth three-pointer for the Bulls. They played well the entire night at the offensive end of the floor. They've moved the ball well, and they continue to generate quality shots. Sessions, nobody near him, takes the three. Can't connect from way downtown. And I'm pretty sure his coach didn't give him the green light for that type of shot. Terrific ball movement with the wide open look. This is the three. This is what dug this hole for this team. In the first half, they didn't guard, and they're doing the same thing here in the second half. And a foul. Washington shooting 75% from the line in tonight's game. First free throw, perfect. Ramon Sessions to the line, shooting two. Able to convert on both free throws. Chicago's leading Washington by a score of 81 to 68. Gets it off. That's a two-pointer. Beal the rebound. Oh, quick move. Gets inside. Puts it up for two. And Pau Gasol with his 18th rebound. To the rim, hits for two. Chicago shooting 39% from the field. Now that's nice body control right there to adjust your body and still be able to finish the layup. Sends it to the corner. Wall against Miritich for the layup. Gets it to go. And John Wall with 34 points. Beats his man. Gasol draws the double team. The Bulls with the offensive rebound for another possession. Unable to flip it in. Could we pass the ball more than once, please, before we shoot? Is that too much to ask? There's the whistle. Good job to draw the foul. And Ramon Sessions will go to the line. He's two for two from the line tonight. Excellent offensive play right there. Contact, finish just didn't get it to drop for the three-point play opportunity. Chicago's leading Washington by a score of 83 to 71. To Gibson, to the basket. There's the whistle. Nice job drawing the foul. And Taj Gibson will go to the line and shoot for the first time tonight. I really like what I saw there. 
good strength, good athleticism, took the foul, got up a nice shot, just didn't roll in. Looking for the home run pass. Wall against Miritich, throws it down. Oh, that's nice right there. The finish at the rim with the nice dunk. Gasol's looking to operate from down low. Rose jump shot. Touch the... They're not this time. He's a great shooter, but he could have driven the ball into the paint and made a play for his teammates. To Sessions. To the rim, able to knock it down. And Ramon Sessions with five points in the third quarter. Making the defense work with excellent ball movement. Able to connect, and it's now a double-figure lead. Taj Gibson with 17 points and 11 rebounds. Oh, and they come right back for two. When you have a mid-range game, you have a catch-and-shoot game in that area of the floor, it's almost impossible to defend. Rose won't go on the adjusted attempt. I like it. I, I'm seeing more effort in the last couple minutes than we saw in the first half. It may not result in a win here tonight, but the effort is something they can build on going forward. To Gibson. He's averaging six boards per game this season. Excellent ball movement, great teamwork. For three, no go from beyond the arc. You gotta figure out how you can get a better quality shot and use your greatness to attract the second defender and find the open man. Sends it into the post. In the paint. Gasol, shot for two, misses. Hey, that shot right there is exactly the type of shot you have to force if you're the defensive team trying to work your way back into the game. Moving the ball, excellent teamwork. Oh, he knocks it down. Two points. The assist from... Number 16, Kyle Gasol. Wall jump shot. Not able to hit from beyond the line. Poise and precision will get you a better quality shot than that. That's a bailout shot. That's a, I'm going to try to get us back in and be a hero type of shot. Nice move into the paint. Ref blows the whistle. He's got a foul. And he'll head to the line for the third time tonight. Give him credit. He's been very solid at the free throw line tonight. Off the mark on the first free throw. Now this is the second one as well. Entering the game for the ball. Snell. For two. Gets that one to drop. Nikola Miritich with 17 points. You need guys who can make shots under duress and pressure. That was a well-defended possession, but that man stuck it even against the best defense. Rose throws it down. Oh, that's a sweet finish right there. Dunking the ball with strength and force. To the basket, flips it up. It's good. And one. Bradley Beal picks up his first personal of the night. That's great body control right there. Finishes the shot and now goes to the free throw line. At the rim, there's the whistle. And Bradley Beal will go to the line. He's two for two from the line. Hey, you don't see strength like that very often. The way he got fouled just to get the ball up into the rim was a great achievement. Good bounce back, hitting the second free throw. He's one for two. Gibson 
Derrick Rose with his sixth assist of the night. Look, you can't give up layups like that. You got to protect the basket and the paint at all costs. Puts it in right back for two. Marcin Gortat with nine points. Hey, you can only control what you can control. The defense there was great. It was just a better shot. From beyond the arc, won't go for three. Sessions coming across to the rim. Nice adjustment. Misses the layup. Hey, you got to finish strong on those shots. You're right at the basket. You got to put the ball in the hole. To Snell. He's got five points in this matchup. Oh, an authoritative dunk. If that's the best he can do as a defender, then he has to come out and sit next to me as the coach. You've got to keep the ball handler out on the perimeter and make him take jump shots. Follows up and knocks it down for two. He's got 13 points thus far. Hey, you see a guy put his body on the line in the paint and then convert that into two points? That just infuses a sense of passion in his teammates. Fires again. The two-pointer won't go. Rose bringing it up here, curling in, inside. That's good. And Derrick Rose with 18 points. You want to keep attacking the basket and get layups around the rim. That's how you score consistently. Walls not able to hit the three. To Snell. Goes to the goal. An easy layup, and it won't go. I like what I see. Keep attacking the basket. It's good. A two-pointer. March in Gortat with 11 points. Number seven, Ramon Sessions. Careless ball handling, and it's out of bounds. It looks like some substitution is going to be made now for the team. Free blows his whistle. It's a reach in foul. Bradley Beal. That's his second personal foul. Team foul number three. Washington. Passes it right back. McDermott against Beal for three off the catch and shoot. The Bulls with control on the rebound. Noah shot misses for two. Can hit the three. Nene's 0 for two from outside. And a foul is called. And the call will get him to the free throw line for the first time this evening. A good offense is about getting the ball in your best players' hands in their best spots. And then all the great offensive players have a knack for drawing fouls. This great free throw shooter has earned his way to the charity stripe, and that's smart basketball. Adjusting in the air. Rebound handled by Nene. He's averaging five rebounds per game this season. To the rim. No other rebound. Rose moving the ball around beautifully. Kicks it out to the corner. Snell. Snell fires for three. Where's the defense? Three-point field goal. Let's it go for two. Able to put it in. Chicago's leading Washington by a score of 103 to 93. To Snell. Tony Snell with eight points and one assist. Rose on the drive. Gets a piece of it. Puts it up. Nice finish around the rim. Quarter winding down. He just flips it up. Third quarter in the books. Washington's down by eight. As we begin the fourth, to get this impressive road win, they're going to have to have a huge fourth quarter because they put themselves behind a little bit now. Well, no doubt. When you're on the road, you've got a choice when you're down going in the fourth. Give in or give up or show the character that you're made of and fight to make it a game 
in the last two or three minutes. Gets a good look. And Washington's called for the foul. Their first team foul. And Aaron Brooks will go to the free throw line for the first time tonight. That's really good basketball right there. One of your best free throw shooters draws a foul. Now is able to really add on to the lead that they've established in this close game down the stretch. Porter fires. Porter's two-pointer won't go. To Snell. Tony Snell with eight points and five rebounds. Strong finish at the rim. See, that's their problem there defensively. They're allowing the ball to get deep in the paint and right at the basket. You cannot defend like that and win basketball games. Gets to the rim and a nice finish at the basket. That's nice body control right there on that layup. Good finish. To the rim, whistle blows, it's a foul. Aaron Brooks picks up his first of the night. And it's back to the free throw line for two more free throws. I really like this play right here. You're a great free throw shooter, draw the contact, and get two freebies. Good free throw shooting knocks down a pair. Into the game for the Chicago. Chicago's leading Washington by a score of 109 to 99. The pass picked off. Good work to draw the foul. And it's off to the free throw line. Aaron Brooks, that's his second personal foul. Team foul number two. And he hits the first free throw. Garrett Temple to the line, shooting two. Just can't get it to go from the free throw line. Another miss. Brooks. Set to bring it up, but just the shot. Can't get the layup to go. Hey, that's how they created the lead. They got the ball to the rim, they just missed that. Slams it down. A look at the athleticism exploding up to finish with the hammer. Brooks on the drive, throws it back. For the layup. No doubt about it, he hit him. It's called against McDermott. And Jared Dudley will go to the line for the first time tonight. That's good basketball. Getting an easy opportunity. They fouled you, but now you have one of your strongest free throw shooters going to the line. Goes two for two at the line. Two minutes gone by in the fourth. Washington's down by five. And that's his 11th rebound of the game. Down into the lane. In the paint. Gets it to go. Three-point game. Pass to the corner. Puts up the three with no one near him. That's good. He's averaging 20 points per game this season. You're in tight quarters when you're behind the three in the corner. Good job keeping his feet inbound, rising up, and making the three. Oh, he takes him off the dribble to the basket. It's up and in. Sometimes the simplest plays are the hardest ones to execute. Good layup. To the rim, puts it in right back for two. You're not going to see a better possession in the NBA from both sides of the ball. Good defense, good offense, good offense won out that time. On the drive. Can't bring it home. Hey, that's a good look right there. Just couldn't get it in. Rose. Chicago's leading Washington by a score of 114 to 108. Big offensive rebound. Unable to flip it in. Gets it off. Unable to flip it in. It's all about making your teammates better. And the way you make them better is to give up a good shot to try to create a great shot. 
pass into the post. And kicks it back out. Right back. Gets inside. No good on the layup attempt. Getting the ball to the rim is so important to winning basketball. Great offense, great look. Just couldn't knock it in. Nice ball movement. Into the paint. To the basket, gets it to go. Nice play from Derrick Rose. And looks like we've got a 20-second timeout. Jeff, what's the coach's thought process right now? Hey, sometimes you just don't want to see your team for more than 20 seconds, and they don't want to see you. Let's be honest. You give them a quick point, and you want to go back to the bench because you're so tired of seeing the same guys night after night, day after day, and they're sick of you, too. Won't go. That's the mark of a great defensive team. Great closeout, great contest. That's the way to get it done. Knocks it down. Four-point game. Chicago's leading Washington by a score of 116 to 112. To Rose. He's averaging 17 points per game this season. Terrific ball movement. Inside. Up and in. Solid fundamental layup, but look at the explosive athleticism to drive up to the basket. Pretty reverse layup. That's just a nice layup right there. To Gibson. Taj Gibson with 25 points and 13 rebounds. Wide open. Puts it in. Sweet play from Jimmy Butler. They played well the entire night at the offensive end of the floor. They've moved the ball well, and they continue to generate quality shots. Gibson's trying to get down low. Nobody near him for three. Can't hit from long distance. Too many wide open looks. You're not going to make a comeback if you're just relying on a plan of hoping the other team misses. Rose into the front court. Making the defense work with excellent ball movement. Oh, nice move, two points. The assist from and now he moves around the defender, lets it go, misses the two. Great contest on that shot, Mike. He had the shot timed perfectly to challenge and force the miss. And Marcin Gortat will get to the free throw line to shoot. He's three for four from the line here tonight. Into the game for Washington, number 17, Gary. So he hits the first and misses the second. Gets it, quickly shoots that three. Shot from way outside, no good. I'm disappointed. This type of defense is not championship caliber winning defense in the second half of a close game. Oh, killer crossover. Rose on the drive and flips it home. And your first priority as a defense is to force them to shoot jump shots. When there's a drive, there's got to be help and make them kick the ball out to the perimeter and then close out. Excellent ball movement, great teamwork. Wide open for three. Great offensive rebound. Miritich against Porter. To the basket, flips it up. Layup won't go. No paint game. No winning. You've got to get the ball at the basket, and then you've got to finish when you get it there. It's good. Four-point game.
throws against Wall. Gets right inside. Oh, you all oh, the putback with authority. That's a big time rebound. You want to win down the stretch of a close game, you've got to do it by getting more quality shots than your opponent. Puts it in, a two-pointer. And John Wall with 42 points. Hey, you can only control what you can control. The defense there was great. It was just a better shot. Moving the ball, excellent teamwork. Looks to the post. Inside to the basket. Two-pointer won't go. Hey, that shot right there is exactly the type of shot you have to force if you're the defensive team trying to work your way back into the game. Quick move to get inside. Strong to the goal. Scores the goal and the foul. That's big time play right there. Finishing the shot through the contact and now goes to the free throw. Able to convert the free throw and he completes the three point play. Gasol lets it fly. Not that time. You've got to figure out how you can get a better quality shot and use your greatness to attract the second defender and find the open man. Curls in, a good look for two, nails it. This is the type of action we've grown accustomed to in the NBA. This back and forth where the lead change often throughout the game. This is exactly the type of exhilarating basketball that I would pay to see. Moving the ball around beautifully. Gets to the rim. Up and in from Jimmy Butler. As we wind down the fourth, there's a timeout. Look at that release of that layup. Up and over the outstretched hand and the shot block. Beautiful touch. Chicago's leading Washington by a score of 129 to 128. Attacks the basket, puts it up and in. What a play from Ramon Sessions. Oh, look at the use of the body to create the space to get the ball up and in the basket. Nice job. On the drive, and he flips it up and in. No wasted activity right there. Took it straight to the rim and finished the lane. Come right back down the floor to knock it down. I love watching the attackers in our league be able to adjust, adapt, and then ultimately finish at the basket. The two defenders swarm. There's the pick. To Gibson. He's averaging 10 points per game this season. Nice right there. The finish at the rim with the nice dunk. Blows past the defender. Second chance opportunity on the offensive rebound. The Saul. Puts it up for two, he knocks it down. What a clutch play. Hey, sometimes good offense beats good defense. There's nothing to be ashamed with on that possession. That was a well-defended, well-contested. Knocks it down, three-point game. When you go to the rim, you gotta go hard and you gotta go strong, finishing over the top of his defender. Intercepted. What was he thinking on that play? Who was he trying to pass to? on the first free throw. Goes one for two. They now lead by four. And a timeout call, very little time remaining. When you're in a two possession game, you don't really need to do anything special to get back in it. All you need to do is execute out of the timeout, 
get a score, and then have your defense lock in and lock down, get a stop, and then get out on the break. Gasol on the drive. Drop steps toward the rim to Gibson. Taj Gibson with 29 points and 16 rebounds. And there's a shot clock violation. So they get the clock to stop with the foul. This is the first. It's one of two to up the lead to five. And Fred Hoiberg calls time as this one's coming to an end. This one of the books. The final score is 138 to 133. For Jeff Van Gundy and our entire EA Sports crew, this is Mike Breen saying thanks for joining us and good night. Here we go with the EA Sports post game wrap up. The Wizards finished with a narrow victory on the scoreboard. They were able to rely on scoring efficiency that wasn't necessarily outstanding, but it was definitely great. Well, great enough to add a W to their win column. The Bulls are probably frustrated with themselves after such a narrow loss. Chemistry was clearly not the issue today because they were definitely sharing the ball well. Still, Everyone knows they'd rather be sharing the joy of a victory. Game track. Points in the paint. This was a game for old school fans of basketball. The way these players worked in the paint, earning points the hard way, definitely put a smile on my face. And now, up on the screen, the game stats. Player of the game. John Wall certainly did his part in the victory, and that's why he's our selection. He couldn't be contained offensively, and he put on quite a show on his way to being the game leader in points. He was most destructive in the paint, really establishing himself around the rim. The defense struggled to stop him and never really figured him out. Who was cold? Every player that makes it to the NBA is a great athlete, but even the best players have their off nights. Today was just one of those days for this guy. These are the top plays of the game. Number three. Number two. Number one. On behalf of ESPN on EA Sports, I'm Jalen Rose, and it's been our pleasure to present you with some NBA basketball.